Hello and welcome to the um, sixth video in this uh, video tutorial series regarding um, file systems. Um, as you can see, we're going to be talking about file exists. Um, not really much of a difficult thing to do. Um, file exists can check to see whether a file or directory I exists. It, it takes one argument, which is then the file path. Um, so let's just show you first of all. Um, if you haven't watched the previous tutorial, um, then we'll, we'll do this comprehensively anyway. Um, at the moment, this is the um, um, the document root of the web server which we're using as an example, and we're currently executing the fs.php file. Um, uh, file, sorry. What we're going to do as an example is we're going to test that um, the test directory, as you can see here, exists, and then we'll do then a um, a, a test that the example.txt file exists as well. All right. So, without further ado, let's go on. Now, uh, as you've seen in previous tutorials, to know what the current working directory that we're in, um, we're simply going to say then current working directory or CWD, and then we're going to use the function of CWD. Now, we also I know that this is not going to have um, a, a forward slash on the end, so I'm going to add one on the end as well. Um, now, so a simple st um, if statement, we're going to say if uh, file exists, and we'll say then cwd and then test. Okay, I'm not going to put a forward slash on the end because this is a directory which we're testing if it exists. And if it does, we're going to echo out um, this file stroke directory um, exists. All right, nothing more than that. Now, like I said, this, I this test. Um, is a directory and it's not a file. Although this says file exists, it will assist us to work out if it um, exists or not. All right. Now there are other ways to test if a directory is a directory, uh, obviously. So let's just execute this code, and as you can see, it says this file forward slash directory exists, which is whoops the exact um, response that we were expecting. Now when we go into the test directory, we then have example.txt now we're testing whether an actual file is a file and whether it exists okay so um, this one now would be then um, this file exists simple as that let's refresh it and as you can see this file exists now I, I don't think it needs any more explanation that file exists returns either true or false true if it does find the file or directory and false if it doesn't find the file or directory. Now as you've seen um, it doesn't matter whether we put a forward slash on the end for the file uh, for the directory um, so let's just, just to show you that this actually does work refresh the file exists so um, essentially that's just all it does alright it's a really really simple thing file exists alright now naturally if we're talking about directories as well, um, regarding if you want to know um, if a directory exists, you don't always need to use file exist. For me, um, to see your code, um, whether it, it uh, um, it's clearer at a later stage when you look back at it, you think, oh, wait a minute, is that a file that I've made or is that a directory which I've made? Um, it's sometimes better if you're going to test to see whether a directory exists, is to use is directory. Um, this will do the same thing as such, and we'll just say if is directory, and we can then echo out uh, yes, this is a, a directory. Nothing more than that. Refresh this. Yes, this is a directory. Now, just to show you that this will um, work on uh, directories, we'll test the file as well if it is a directory. Now, we know it's not a directory because we created it as a file. Um, but just for the sake of testing, uh, we'll test it anyway. As you can see, it outputs nothing as we expected because um, example.txt is not a file. Now, um, the easiest way of knowing this is coming if you're a Linux user, then an, or Windows user, you know that it's you know it's got the yellow symbol and so on. It's a folder. Um, but on the end of the file here, when you do an ll long list, um, it then has a d on the end. Uh, on the beginning, sorry, if it is a folder, and it then just has a dash if it's an actual file. 
so there's an indication for you to work out whether it's a file um, or a folder but it's not not rocket science to understand um, okay um, that's it I'm not going to go on any further about this so two different ways to really check if a file exists um, for a file use file underscore exists and if it's a directory you've got two options is is underscore dir is directory or then file underscore exists once again okay so let's get rid of that so we don't get any confusion that's it my name is david thorne very very simple um, tutorial um, subscribe like thumbs up all of the normal social networking things that you might want to do i uh, hope that you've taken something away from this um, okay thanks bye bye